guys, if you are new here, I'm Emma. I'm a research scientist at Stanford University. It's been a while since I posted the day of my life video, so I thought that I'd bring you guys along to spend the day with me. A morning glass of water always comes first. I like to heat it up for 30 seconds with a microwave. Then it gets to temperature my stomach loves the most. I drink it with all the supplements like multivitamins, omega-3, and enzyme Q. Plus that, two pieces of ginseng is also a must to start the day. Then I cook my coffee with this lovely mocha pot I've been using. For breakfast, I simply mix chia seed pudding I made the night before with peanut butter and some berries. As having breakfast, I'm watching some little videos as a pre-workout of my brain. Then, I head over to brush my teeth, wash my face, and fill it with some toner and cream. Officially, the day starts. If you have watched my morning routine video, it has changed a lot. I moved to workout to the evening since I feel smarter in the morning. So, gotta eat the frog first. Prioritizing the most difficult job and get it done, the rest of the day can be much easier and happier. So solving one or two legal questions is the first task of the day. Thinking back to when I took my data structure and algorithm bootcamp in October last year, it took me about six hours to understand one legal question. I definitely feel much comfortable in my own skin after half a year of practice. Around 9, I take a walk around the neighborhood. The second half of the morning study session is about machine learning. Basically, I'm reviewing the content taught in the bootcamp. The project I'm been practicing right now is trying to combine CAR-T therapy with machine learning algorithms. Then, it's my favorite lunchtime. I eat pretty the same thing every day. Salmon, avocado, egg, and some kimchi. Normally, I do meal prep on Sunday, so I can mix them up for a lunch bowl in a few minutes. Repeating what I eat definitely helped me to remove the decision fatigue, save me the time to calculate macronutrients and calories. Plus, it's freaking delicious. I can never get tired of eating it. After lunch, I drive to the lab. It normally takes me about 20 minutes to drive to the lab. Actually, I don't really need navigation since I drive the same way every day, but still I'm gonna set it up. Sometimes I'm listening to audiobook, sometimes podcast, or just listening to my playlist. Recently, I'm pretty obsessed with a song called Late Night Talking from Harry Styles. Let's hit the road, shall we? Sometimes I do experiments alone, or sometimes I do experiments with my students. Today I have some solo experiments. I'm going to isolate some DNA and do some transduction to produce the CAR T cells. If you don't know what CAR T cells are, it means uh, we took the blood from human, isolate the T cells and do some gene engineering to enable the T cells to see and kill the cancer cells. An easy way to put it would be injecting Steve Rogers with Super Soldier Serum so he becomes Captain America. It is super fun and rewarding process. Actually, the CAR T cells we are using have entered the clinical phase one this year. What I'm doing right now is to engineer the CAR T cells to give it another superpower so it can be visualized with imaging. Just to check if it will attack other organs except for the cancer cells. We call it off-target effect. Okay, normally I stay in the lab until 6 to 7 p.m. and drive back home. Hello, good evening, it's 7 p.m. I'm sitting here wearing a dress. Obviously something special gonna happen tonight. I'm going to attend the annual Venice Ball in Stanford. I'm very excited because it's gonna be the first ball I attend in my life. But I still get a bootcamp course to attend in a few minutes. It's about reinforced learning. We have already learned the theoretical part and did a small project in last week. And today we're gonna do an intermediate project. So I definitely don't want to miss it. 
Although the course actually will get recorded and uploaded later, but I think at least I will follow the first hour. It will make it much easier for me to follow up tomorrow. Okay, so let's do the camp first, and then I will take you guys to the bar. Just to find you 